Good morning, it's time for our children's story this morning. And today I brought with me some gloves. Now, different gloves have different kinds of uses. And can you guess what kind of use these gloves are for? Right, they're work gloves. And you guessed it, we use them for work. We use them to protect our hands when we work, perhaps from something that is dirty or something that is cold or rough or full of splinters or it's sharp and could cut us. Now, when I was growing up with my dad, he owned his own business. And it was a welding shop where we fixed things made out of metal or more often than not, we were building things. We, were, we built a lot of livestock equipment, things like gates for farms and feeders for animals and gate, uh, chutes and trailers and scales and, and the list goes on. And so when I was about eight or nine, I started working in my dad's welding shop. Every Saturday morning, we would go to the weld shop and do some work, maybe for half the day, maybe for the whole day. And then during vacation, during summer vacation or March break or things like that, I would go and work at my dad's weld shop. And one of the first things we always did as soon as we came into the shop in the morning was we would grab a pair of work gloves and we would put them on. And we'd get to work. So it always reminds me of work that I'm ready to work when I put on work gloves like this. Now, it's quite often when we work, we are working for ourselves, right? We're working to earn some money. We're working to get paid. But in the story this morning about Jesus, he says that if anyone wants to become my followers, let them deny themselves, let them take up their cross and follow me. For what will it profit them to gain the whole world and forfeit their life? What he means is that we are not supposed to work for ourselves. We are supposed to do our work for others. We are supposed to help others. We are supposed to work to make the world a better place. We are supposed to put others first ahead of ourselves. And sometimes we will get dirty doing that work. Sometimes it can even be dangerous for us. But we are called to put on our work gloves and get to work for Jesus. Can you pray after me? Let's pray. Dear God, we thank you for Jesus. Thank you for working for us. Help us to work for others. In Jesus' name we pray, amen. Number 211, take up your cross.